guys, this is Goldmine, and welcome to the first episode of a new series, a tutorial series, where I show you all the greatest things that you can do with Outro Maker. So for the first episode, I'm just going to be showing you something very basic. It's just going to be a simple outro with some stock templates that are provided on the website. So the first thing you need to do, obviously, is to log in, connect your Google account if you haven't already, and you'll be taken to the outro section on the website. I've already made outros before, but what you'll want to do is click new, scroll down and then you want to click browse templates and again you guys won't have any templates this will be shown in a later video you're going to switch over to stock and then these are the stock templates that you can use because pokemon go is a new game that everyone loves i'm just going to pick that choose whatever you want and then click next now the reason why you have to connect your google account to outro maker is for this very reason you get to choose what videos that you've actually uploaded onto youtube will be in this outro so i'm going to click my newest video and then let's just click like a random one once you've done that then just scroll to the very bottom and there's actually a preview right here that'll show you what videos will be playing in what section of the actual outro once everything is set to your likings then just click next and now you have to select at what point each video will start playing in your outro so i'm just gonna pick a random spot for all of these i'll just mute that real quick so for my first video it's gonna start at 28 seconds as you can see right here and my other video is going to start at a minute 38 and also up here this is is the duration that you get to choose of how long you want the outro to actually be. I'm just going to keep it at the default 15 seconds. Click finish when you're done. And as you can see, a new little thing popped up here. This is your newest outro that's being created right now. And this is where you're actually going to download. And this is also where you can preview your outro once the check mark has appeared in the status section indicating that it's complete. All right, so now we're going to preview it really quick. And as you can see, this is what the outro is going to look like whenever you put it at the end of your video. When you're happy with your outro you just want to click download and that's it i really hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe in the next video of this series i'm going to be teaching you guys the amazing annotation tool that outro maker actually has just making annotations so much easier to place i'll see you guys later this is goldmine and i'm out